Hey everybody, we are here on day two of SEMA 2021 and uh, this is one of my favorite interviews to do when we're here. Um, we are at the McLeod booth, although there are many, many other things within McLeod and I'm going to let Krista talk about this, but more importantly, we are here with Krista Baldwin. Krista wears lots and lots of hats these days and uh, not only a top fuel <laughs> racer, which we will get to later, uh, but you are also head of marketing, right? You are, yes. it's bigger than that now though. It's a, it's a lot bigger. I mean, it's funny because you've been with me as I like know, a I know, so then I was like, oh no, I'm going to get the wrong title. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, yeah, it's super exciting. We're here at SEMA. Uh, we are representing three different companies, McLeod Racing, FTI Performance, Silver Sport Transmissions, which is our newest acquired just company. Just not that long ago. No, just, just a, a couple few, months ago. Yeah, exactly. A couple months ago. And so that's all under the Warren Automotive Group, which is Paul Lee, Nitro Funny Car Racer. Awesome, awesome boss. I mean, I can't get over <laughs> that I work for Paul Lee. It's pretty fun. So, but yeah, uh, the biggest thing is Silver Sport Transmissions. Yeah. Uh, some cool things about them yes, is please. they are elite Tremec distributors. Okay. So all those Tremec transmission projects that you need out there, we have them and we have installation kits. So you can ha literally come one stop shop and you can get everything for your drivetrain, including a McLeod clutch. Wow, how does that work? How, does that work? <laughs> how do those things fit it's like together? Magic. It's like magic. It's like magic. I had to assume that was part of the interest in the acquisition, right? That these things Absolutely. merge seamlessly. Yes, and, and that's just, you know, Paul has this five-year plan, and just seeing it all come to fruition is just a really fun journey that we've been on. And I'm not going to lie, there's probably going to be another announcement before the end of the year. Oh, so I'm excited. Yep, I'm I get to redo excited. all our shirts again. <laughs> love it. I mean, let's not forget that not that long ago, like Paul had to retire from drag racing, is drag racing again. I'm sure I had to turn some of that attention into like was already running, you know, yes, absolutely. Company, and now is doing all this and drag racing. Yes, yes. And which this is, is crazy. It's been it's been a lot of fun because I'm also the team manager for Paul's Nitro Funny Car. Yeah. And just to see the journey with him on the racing side, you know, how we've progressed and, you know, I got to see firsthand what it means to own a full-fledged Nitro Funny Car team and go through all the billing and the DOT and the paperwork and the logistics and all that good stuff that no one wants to do on a race team. Uh, I get to do it, but it just, you know, it's another feather in my cap that I can Absolutely. check off the list. Absolutely. <laughs> well, we look forward to whatever the announcement is going to be. Hopefully, <laughs> do you think it's going to be a PRI or do you think it's going to be after? You don't I don't know. know. It's going to be at Paul. won't hold you to it's gonna it. It's going to be at Paul. <laughs> <laughs> we definitely won't hold you into that, but we'll be looking forward to it. It's really exciting to see all of these options and again all of the stuff that goes so perfectly with that original company with the McLeod stuff so yes you know, and, you know then we go into the FTI side yeah. which is uh, torque converters automatic transmissions turbo 400s power glides transfer cases for you crazy off-road people but man it's it's cool it's it's it, I'm, honestly, I, I don't go to work every day. I, I have fun with everything I do. <laughs> so that's the cool part. And um, we have great products to back it up. Exactly. So that's even better. Exactly. Like it's one mm -hmm. of those things where you never mind talking about them because <laughs> they're they're really good products. They're tested. They're true. They're used in, you know. Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, shoot, we all drag race. Yeah, so exactly. we, we're you testament know. to it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and they work. Um, I do want to pivot just for a minute because I really do want to talk about your race career. <laughs> Again, have followed you over the last several years. We've gone through Top Alcohol. Now, now Alice, Top how's Fuel. It been? Oh my gosh. It, so, this was my first year in a yeah. Top Fuel dragster. Insane. It's so crazy driving a Top Fuel car. I mean, 11,000 horsepower, three seconds, 330 miles an hour. You literally can't make this stuff up. And it's, people always ask me like, what does it feel like in the car? And I'm like, I literally can't describe it. Right. I can't because it's just so amazing. The technology and the performance that you have, you have to be absolutely perfect every single run for four seconds with no mistakes to make a flawless run. So it's, it's a lot, but man, that adrenaline and that high you get off of it it just it's so it's so cool and it's everything I ever thought it would be and more oh, that's the best. And especially to do with my family and do with my best exactly. friends be on the road with them that's the coolest part and uh, we have so much fun we all and that's that's what life is all about is having fun I mean life is for the living and you have to live it absolutely <laughs> when you transition what do you think was the hardest thing to figure out between those two classes like the hardest thing is just 
the amount of horsepower that right. these cars put out, every little correction you do during the down track, it's amplified from okay. the alcohol car just because we're just making that much more horsepower and it's that much faster. Right. Uh, the biggest thrill of it, I think, is uh, about half track when the clutch and the motor come one right. to one. Right. It's literally launching again. I mean, we are have four to five Gs on the starting line. In the middle of the track, you add another one to two Gs. And then at the end of the track, when you pull the parachutes, it's negative seven Gs. And all of that's happening within four seconds. <laughs> that is amazing. It's I can't even imagine. It's literally the ride of your life. And I'm just so, so grateful that this is me. This is my life. And I get to live it like this. <laughs> uh, we're so happy to hear that. What does next season look like? What Do you, do you know yet? Or are you still trying to next figure out? Next season, it, I'm going to double it. I'm going to go to okay. 10 races. Ugh. So I'm super, like, that's, you believe me, I'm living, woman, <laughs> I'm literally living the dream. I hope you guys know that. Ever since I was a little girl, I wanted to drive a top field dragster. And now that the hard work has finally persevered and I've kept my head down and I hustled, hustled, hustled. You've watched me hustle for the have. last couple of years. And now it's finally coming to fruition. And just the, I just love driving the car still. I still am in oh. awe of what I get to perform on the racetrack with. That's amazing. Well, and you've seen, like, firsthand, obviously, with your family and with Paul, like, it's not something it's easy to let go of either. No, right? it's definitely. <laughs> so according, according to just stop. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if, if anything, I have at least another 60 years right? to catch up to my right? grandpa. That's so funny, so. too, right? <laughs> <laughs> You're like, all right, goal. I got a plan. Yes. Well, we're so proud of you. We're so happy to see that success. You've earned every second Thank of you. it. Thank um, you. Thank you. But again, we're thrilled to see the acquisition. We're thrilled to see the company growing, see your successful career, to see Paul still out there. Oh, yes. And it, it's so much, fun. like I said, it's cool to live Paul's dream, too. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I don't get to race every weekend, but I race every weekend with Paul. Right. And it just, it's cool to see him go out there and run a 392 this last weekend in Vegas. I mean, it's just, it's so cool. It's yeah. so much fun. It's cool being that side of the the race team as well. Not yeah. just the driver, but also the supporter. Exactly. So. You really do get to wear all that. <laughs> well, again, congratulations. We will be following everybody. Please, if you guys are here at SEMA, come down. I'm going to keep calling it the McLeod booth, even though Yeah, it's no. okay. I mean, McLeod's in there. It is. Absolutely. <laughs> exactly. But, so we'll look forward to that announcement. And uh, other than that, thank you very much, guys. <laughs>